guys! So I recently went to New York City for my friend's Christmas present. I bought us bus tickets to New York City. I live in the Syracuse area when I'm home, so it's like a five hour drive. So I bought us tickets to go to New York City for a Christmas present and I thought I'd do a haul because I got a few things while I was there and I had some things from before that trip that I had to show you. So I'm kind of just going to be adding in things I got before the trip with the New York City stuff and I thought I'd show you in a haul and it's going to be try on because I know everyone loves try on hauls. As you can tell, I'm back in my room at home. I'm home for like another week before I go back to college. As you can tell by the tapestry, um, I know I'm gonna get questions, it's from eBay. If you just search tapestry on eBay, a bunch will come up and you can probably find this one. Also something I wanted to note before I got into the haul, um, I do have a lot of clothes, as you can see by all of my haul videos, and I do not keep all of those. <laughs> I don't wear all of them, which is bad, I should. But because of that, I've been selling a bunch of things on my Poshmark. Especially while I'm home from college, I just need to get rid of a lot of the stuff that I haven't been wearing. So if you don't have a Poshmark account, basically it's like an eBay just for like clothes and accessories. I swear I'm not sponsored by them at all. It's just like a website or it's an app that a lot of people use. You can also use it on the computer, but it's just really helpful and it's great to buy stuff on. I've bought so many things on Poshmark from other sellers that I've been looking for for a lot cheaper. Anyways, my username on Poshmark is Tasha Farsage. I'm gonna put that down below, but if you do not have Poshmark, I'll put my invite code as well because you guys get like $10, I think, when you sign up with it. So you could use that towards my stuff, hint, hint, or like anything else. I just figured I'd put it in there once again, not sponsored or anything, but everyone gets one when they sign up. So if you wanna use mine, that'd be awesome. Okay, so I'm gonna get into some things. Before I have the stuff from New York, I have some stuff from Shein and Romwe. And you guys probably know that I have hauled from them numerous times in the past. And they always send me the items. They love working with YouTubers. And the thing with the website is they, they have a lot of really good items, but they're very questionable because a lot of the time the images on their websites are not the actual items. So I get all excited. I'm like, yeah, I wanna work with them. They have some awesome pieces. And then I get them in the mail and I'm like, oh, they're not the same. Some of the stuff I do really like, but some of the items I really do not like. So just wanted to throw that out there. They sent me these things. They did not pay me to make this video. But if you're planning on ordering from Shein or Ramwe, I definitely recommend being like weary. Weary? Is that the right word? Leery? Just like don't expect the things to look exactly like the pictures. And if you want anything that I got, at least you'll be seeing them now. So I'm going to start off with the stuff from Shein. I actually don't like anything, but um, yeah. By the way, if I don't try any items on, it's because I really don't like how they fit or I just don't like them in general. <laughs> so that's why some things will be try on and then some things won't be. Okay, the first thing from Shein is this black and white dress and I would like it except the material is very odd. Um, it ties in the middle. I have a dress like this that I wear all the time, but this material is like, spandexy I don't know it's kind of weird and it's like awkwardly long on me this goes to like my knee and this type of dress just on me a short person does not look cute to the knees this next item from Shein I don't hate at all um I might keep this one I don't remember what it looked like on so we'll see I think this one was a little long too it's just like a t-shirt dress kind of thing it's long sleeved gray and white and the back was really cool because it's like a v-cut once again I'm pretty sure this was a little bit long but this is good material, it's thick, it's nice, this one's fine. I just remember it not quite fitting how I wanted it to, so, eh. Ramway and Shein have a lot of free people inspired items on their website, and the thing is they'll use the images from free people's website, so you never really know how they're gonna turn out, and I've gotten a few things that are really great, and then there's things that are just not great, so, I got this dress that is nothing like the free people one, and I actually wanted the Free People one, and so when I saw this, I'm like, okay, I'll try it out. It's really not bad. It's just the material that they use. It's just, like, not my favorite material. And plus, this one, like, cinches in the front, whereas the real one doesn't. Once again, too long on me, too big on me. Not a bad dress. It has, like, some cute patterns. It's just not flattering on me, so probably not going to keep this one. This next dress would be cute if it was the same color as the website. It was like a burgundy kind of plum color on the website, but when I got it, it was red. So it's just, it's really cute. Um, it's just not the color that it was on the website, which is just annoying. Um, sleeves look like this. Back has some like open cutouts. I'm just not a huge fan of red. So if you like red, this would be great for you. I just, 
I just didn't think it would be bad. <laughs> Last but not least, I do like this top. It just fits odd. It's supposed to be like a top that wraps in the front and you tie it in the back. And I just remember it fitting kind of weird. There's nothing wrong with it. But yeah, I don't know. It looks like this off and then you're supposed to like tie these things around your body and tie them in the back. Those are the items from Shein and Shein Side. I'm gonna link them all down below if you're interested in any of them. Okay, moving on to Romway. I do like a lot of this stuff. There's a few things that I don't like, but for the majority, this stuff was good. Okay, first thing from Romway, I've worn a few times actually. I really like it. I think it's cute. It's this navy blue sweater, and then it has like this little like snowflake pattern on it. It has a little bit of a high-low hem, which I like. The sleeves are like this. The next thing from Romway is another hit. It's one of those big, um, scarves and this material is actually really soft it's just like a big plaid one um like raw edge hem i think the worst thing that i got was this actually definitely the worst thing um first of all it was red online i really like those dresses that are like sheer on the top and then have like florally lace covering the boobs this is not at all what it looked like um it might show up a little red on screen, but I promise you, this is like neon pink. And this like lining, oh god, I don't know, I really do not like this. This material is not nice at all. Just, I don't know. This part is nice. If this was black, it would be a lot better. It's just that it's neon pink and that it was red online, so yeah. Ugh. Next thing I got is this jacket. Um, it's not bad, I just really don't like it that much. Um, looks like this it's more of a blazer kind of thing it's really not bad it's just not totally my style um it has some like stitching going on and then the back looks like this um, next item is one of the free people lookalikes that actually works um i have this in blue and i love it it's one of my favorite dresses but i washed it and it shrunk like i didn't even dry it i just put it in the washer and it shrunk up to like a shirt so i went to go get the blue one again but they didn't have it they only had white so i got the white um, this is a little bit long on me. I got my last one hemmed, but as you can see, it looks like this. It's just like a shift kind of dress, and then it has like this floral embroidery neckline with like a really raw hem. I don't think I've ever seen the Free People one in person, so I can't tell you, oh, it's exactly the same, but the material is definitely more of a Free People material. It's not that weird material like the other one. I got this t-shirt dress. This one I like more than the other one. Um, it's kind of like a ribbed material. I think it's gray and black. I'm pretty sure that's black. But it's just striped, three quarter sleeves, goes down. This one is a good length on me, um, right where I want it. And it's really cute, so I like this dress a lot. I got a pair of jeans that unfortunately do not fit me, but they're really nice jeans. So they're like a black kind of color, a really dark blue, I don't really know. But um, they have those slits in the knees, which is really popular now. Almost done. I got this gray sweater. Um, it's a really fuzzy kind of thingy majig. The sleeves look really short. Um, I haven't tried this on actually. The sleeves look really short. Um, kind of smells funny, but you know, you expect that. All right, second to last from Romway is this cardigan. I actually really like this. I saw this in someone else's video and I decided I wanted it. It's like a cream color cardigan, sleeves, um, open knit, some pockets, has a hood, and then the back I really like because it like is a different texture at the bottom. I don't know. I thought this one was really cute. It looks cute. Doesn't smell weird. It's good. Okay, last thing from Romway was a pair of over the knee socks. I just don't know where I put them. They're black over the knee socks. They're good. I approve. <laughs> so that's everything from those stores. Sorry that was a ton of stuff. Um, they just sent me a ton of stuff, um, which I don't want to complain about, but as you can see, it's really hit or miss, so yeah. Okay, moving on to what I actually got in New York. The first thing I got were a pair of Uggs, which is crazy to me because I haven't worn Uggs since like ninth grade, and I'm a freshman in college now. Um, but I really like the style of Uggs, and basically what happened is I wore heeled booties to New York City. I don't know, I'm crazy, I want to look cute, but I died and I needed flat shoes and I was wanting these Uggs anyways just to wear when I'm wearing like college clothes or going to the library. So I bought these. They are the mini Bailey Button Uggs in black 
And these were actually on sale. Um, I got them at David Z's, which is just a shoe store in the city. And these were on sale online too, on um, Uggs website. So if, they might just be still online if you're interested. But I think they're really cute. I really like the mini ones. Um, just with like leggings and t-shirts. They're cute, they're warm. It's not that cold in California, but at night it gets a little cold. And like I said, if I'm going to the library, this is really nice. So I like these. I changed into these and wore them around the city. So that was a lifesaver to my feet. So the rest of the stuff is from Lululemon and I kind of am obsessed with Lululemon now. Um, I've been working out more because I have a gym at my school. So, you know, this happened and I had a gift card, so yeah. Okay, first thing I got is a jacket. It's the Define jacket, I'm pretty sure. It is really cute. I'll show you what it looks like. Um, just a black jacket. I like this one because it's not very long. I have a jacket from Lulu that's super long and it just like, I can't zip it up because it looks really awkward. Um, but this one is a really good length. The back has a little logo there and it's really cute. I got this in a four. I used to be a two at Lulu, I think. I'm a two in some things, a four in others. So make sure you try Stefan because their sizing is kind of weird. Um, but this is definitely a fitted jacket, so the two suffocated me a little bit, but it's really cute. I've already worn this a few times. Next thing I got is a tank. It was on sale, so that's nice. Um, it's just a black strappy tank. I'll try and adjust it here. Um, looks like this in the front. It has a little bit of a v-neck, which I like. And then the back looks like this. I just thought it was really cute and I needed a black tank for working out, so. Next thing I got was also on sale. I'm so in love with this. I've already worn it like a bunch of times. It's just a zip up, half zip kind of shirt. It's really soft. It's almost like a sweater material. Um, just goes down, has the long sleeves, and then the bottom, the back looks like this. It's really soft. It's really comfy. I like wearing this. I haven't worn it to work out and I've just worn it lounging around, but I love this. Okay, and the last thing that I got are these In The Flow crops. They are burgundy, they were also on sale. They look really weird when they're off, but I promise you they look normal on, you'll see. Little logo on the back. I really love these ones, these are a four. I'm actually normally a two in bottoms, but the four was the only one left. So I got them and they're fine. Two might be a little bit better, but they're still like perfectly fine. So, I love these. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to try and link as much as I can down below. Please follow me on social media. My Instagram and my Twitter are both Fiercely Tasha. I'm going to put them down below, as well as my Snapchat, which is Tasha Farsage, if you want to view my stories. Leave a comment down below and tell me what your favorite thing was that I got or your favorite thing that you've picked up recently. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye.